to the Mike Leaf Show. Coach Leaf, this weekend, a lot of basketball here in Winona. The Warriors take on Ferris State on Saturday at 3 o'clock, Northwood at 3 o'clock on Sunday. Uh, and, and while that's going on, Concordia St. Paul is also going to come in a, a conference foe. They're going to play those two teams as well. So it's going to be a really good weekend of, of basketball here in Winona. Oh, no question about it. And, and you know, I've always been a uh, – Concordia St. Paul has had talent every single year. They, they do a really good job. I think sometimes it's, it's uh, tough for uh, uh, Kelly Bowe to, you know, there's so much, uh, I don't want to say so much talent, but at the same time, sometimes it's hard to put those things together in the chemistry, but they've always got exciting players. And uh, looking at their roster, they've added some, some nice players as well. So it'll be great having them uh, down here. I'm good friends with, with uh, Kelly. and. Uh, and then, of course, uh, you know, two teams from Michigan that we were at last year in Ferris and Northwood, and two teams that are, you know, they're, they're really good basketball teams, and they have a lot of players that are coming back. You know, they're teams that uh, more so have a presence inside, uh, but it's standard. We, you know, our, my assistant coaches and I were talking uh, yesterday about this and, and how, you know, uh, how they have a, you know, they've grown, they've added some people to it, they're able to shoot the three very well, and uh, you know they've got a couple games under their belt. Um, actually, Ferris State plays uh, um, Wednesday, and so we're going to be able to watch that as well. So it uh, they've got two really good teams, and uh, you know they're they're well rounded, well coached, and it'll be a great weekend of basketball. I, Ferris and Northwoods, two teams uh, from the state of Michigan. Mm -hmm. Do you like playing these quality opponents so early in the season? You know, some teams like to kind of start off a little bit slower and yeah. build their way into conference schedule. But it seems like each year you really try to schedule a, a challenging portion uh, to really get the guys going. Is that something that you really like to do? Yeah, I, you know, different coaches have different philosophies, and I guess it's, uh, it, you know, people will, I guess, pad their schedules to get all the wins, and, and they'll look at their rankings and want to keep them there. And, and you know, my I guess my philosophy is, you, you know, if you're going to, if you're going to, you got to play the best to beat the best. Uh, you know these two teams that we're playing are, are very very talented. They're not nationally ranked uh, or anything like that. But I'm telling you what, uh, they're they're tremendous programs. And so I think it it's good for our players to play against that, especially when our, our conference season is right around the corner. And uh, you know I, I think our sport of all the sports in the NSIC is probably it has the most parity. It has. Uh, I mean, it is the biggest strengths. I've always said anybody out of our conference has a, a oh, and even region, but out of our conference to get to the region, any one of those teams has an opportunity to uh, win the national championship. So it, it's it's really tough, and I think you know you got to play tough opponents before you get that conference season underway. What's the one thing the Warriors have to do this weekend to be successful against these two teams? We have got oh man, we've got a several things, and I'm not kidding you. You know, but it's, we're so close with it. But I, I think, you know, defensively, we're, we're really geared toward guarding a man. And I'm trying to transform this just because of the changes in, in the NCAA rules that, um, you know, and if people don't know, it's, it's the hand checking part and the physical side. We're bringing back the, the finesse to the game. So I, uh, you know, the biggest change is, you know, you've got someone like a Kellen Taylor who, um, you know, gets a hand on somebody is a little bit more physical, and, and for a small, you know, skinny guy, but he, uh, you know, he'll he'll get called for those fouls, and and he got into foul trouble right away in our first game of the year. But defensively, we've got to be in a great help position. We've got to be rotating, but we've got to play the ball. I've kept it very simple: stop the ball, help on the ball, and protect the basket. And uh, you know, rebounding has always been something that we've got to get stronger at as well. Uh, Turnovers is an area, but we we seem to be doing better at that. So I think improvement in all areas. Defensively, we've got to shut people down, and that's the number one goal for this this weekend. Well, it'll be a great weekend of basketball. Again, the Warriors play at three o'clock on both Saturday and Sunday. That's all we have for the Mike Leaf Show this week. Join us next week and throughout the season as we talk to Warrior head coach Mike Leaf.